straight. Here we go back. This is the moment. Tonight is the night. We'll fight till it's over. So we put our hands. Hello, what is going on chaps? Coco Pops here. Welcome back to the channel for more Black Ops 4 Zombies content. We're going to be showing you the online custom mutations glitch inside Rush where you don't have to do any of the Rush locations. This is basically like a master prestige glitch because we can have unlimited specialists sitting in one spot with dogs only for the maximum amount of XP. Now you're going to need two players for this and it's pretty simple to set up. Both players are going to go in towards Zombies and towards the custom mutations. Now the person that wants to have the game rules what he wants to do is hover over the edit game rules with the d-pad and not the analog stick. Go ahead and press the show show and simply join your friend as sitting in a custom mutations lobby. Now from here do not press anything on your controller apart from the press and hold the middle button and simply go ahead and turn off your controller. Now you can disconnect your batteries if you do want if you're like on Xbox or anything and simply tell your friend to hit bring party. Now take that error off your screen and do not press nothing on your controller yet. Go ahead and tell your friend to take you in towards a public match on Rush. Now it cannot be like private match or nothing like that. It has to be in a public match on Rush. Now when we take this into a public match on Rush, we're going to get XP, we're going to get camos, we're going to be able to do contracts, pretty much everything apart from doing any easter eggs, which is pretty sick. Now once we do find the lobby, we're going to head, go ahead and tell our friend to simply hit leave alone. Now what that's going to do is promote us to the host and when we press X on our controller, it's going to bring up the edit game rules which we were hovering over before. Now when you're in these custom rules right here, you cannot set it up like before, but as you can see we can go ahead and put on the power, turn on barricades with like the mystery box and the pack a punch, they're always on anyway on rush mode, so go ahead, put on like your elixirs to times two, your equipment, your specialists, go ahead, put on vermin only and put that to quadruple spawns, put the health to half and the damage, that's got to put on vermin only, so it's just dogs all together, Go ahead to fix your health as well so you have your most amount of health so you cannot die and simply put on your points like maximum. Now once you've set up all that, simply back out and tell your friend to ready up along with yourself. Now once you do ready up and you go in towards a game, I'm going to show you when you get in the XP and how to set up the unlimited specialist. As you can see here, I'm going to hit pause, look at my XP down on the right hand side right here, I'm going to kill these dogs and boom, there is your XP. I'm going to show you one more time, I'm going to kill these dogs right here and boom, still getting XP. This is pretty sick, you can get camos, anything on this rush mode which is pretty cool like I said at the start of the video. What we're going to go ahead and do right now is go ahead, pick up the two scoped weapons which has recon scope, dual zoom or the compact scope so we can get ourselves the unlimited specialist. We're going to go ahead and complete the first two rush locations which is in the new industries and over by the powerhouse. Then once you complete them two, do not go over the catwalk. What you want to do is go through the fast travel. And what that's going to do is basically cancel off the upcoming rush inside the cafeteria and you cannot complete it. Now the only way it's going to activate is if you go over the catwalk, so just do not go over the catwalk. And if, as you can see from here you can make your way all the way around the map, if, just do not touch the catwalk and you'll be completely fine. Now what we're going to do is go ahead and pack a bunch of two scoped weapons. Then what we're going to do is go ahead and find an L ourself another two scoped weapons with the recon, dual zoom or the compact scope. We're going to go up towards the pack a punch, we're going to simply pack a punch these both weapons. It's going to take about 20 seconds to time these pack a punch one gun towards the next gun because it takes a little bit of time for you to pack a punch another. And as you can see we're going to go ahead and buy yourself another two scoped weapons with the recon, dual zoom or the compact. And we're going to simply pack a punch them. So that's six pack a punch scoped weapons with pack a punch all together. And from here that's pretty much glitched out. So what we're going to go ahead and do from here is go ahead and pick up another two scoped weapons from the wall. Does not matter if you've already bought these weapons. As you can see I've already pack a punch these before. So I'm going to go ahead and simply put these inside the pack a punch machine and leave them inside the pack a punch machine. Do not pick them up. And what that's going to do is put a set of crosshairs on your screen and from here you can pull out your specialist weapon and that's going to make that unlimited for the rest of the game. Now I would advise you to use the death machine because it's probably one of the best ones you can sit just in a corner go afk just smashing headshots all together for the maximum amount of xp you can also put on like the dead shot perk if you really want i'm going to basically fade it from here i'm going to go over in towards a corner i'm going to show you again all the way up to the maximum multiplier which is 4095 i believe also ranking up as well i was going to play the video through has been coco pops drop a comment subscribe if you if you thought the video was helpful this is probably the best one you're going to get as of now for maxing up for your max rank and i'll catch you in the next one enjoy bye bye